congratulations on winning through. What does it mean for you to play another Hockey Cup final with Roger, but just to win through to the final? Yeah, it means so much. Um, of course, to be in the final is the most important thing. And um, yeah, I mean, it's just really great that we have another chance to defend the title. I mean, not another chance, but a chance. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'm just really excited and I'm happy that we got through. And you mentioned tonight against Maria. I guess a fair bit of the sting was taken out of it. The result didn't matter. But yeah. you're still happy enough with the way you played in preparation for the final? Um, not really happy. I mean, I played okay, but I think she played great. But um, yeah, I mean, it, this thing was really a little bit off because, you know, we knew with the Rogers win that we are in the final already. So I definitely tried, you know, to make a second point, to make it uh, stand 2-0. But uh, yeah, it didn't go really well, but that's all right. You know, I can take it as a good practice and uh, to be ready for the final. How big a confidence boost knowing that you played last year at one, potentially against Germany again, but how big a confidence boost will that give you going into the final? Uh, yeah, of course, a big confidence boost, you know, the most important thing uh, playing here is just to get a good start to the season, to get some matches in and uh, to feel good on the very similar court to Melbourne and just to feel prepared overall. Okay, um, and we don't know yet whether you're going to be playing Germany or Australia, so Angie Kerber or Ash Barty, they would both be tough opponent, opponents, uh, your thoughts on either of those playing them? Yeah, I think here are all of them tough opponents because it's just top players playing. So it's it's not like you can pick someone you'd rather play, you know. So um, I think Ash is really talented and she plays such a different game than most of the girls. And she had a very good season, um, yeah, last season. And Angie, I know a little bit better because we played a lot of times and we are practicing here together sometimes. And um, yeah, she's definitely a challenge too. I mean, she's number two in the world, so it's definitely a challenge. Yeah. With Roger, you know, the greatest male player in the world, uh, it must give you a, a great lift knowing that you've got Roger alongside you. Yeah, of course, on and off the court, you know, so um, just, you know, having him around and, and like learning from him, looking what he does, it's amazing. And um, yeah, I believe all of the people in the stadium are so jealous of me because I can play with Roger. So um, I get that a lot from other WTA players, and uh, yeah, I'm just really lucky. No, I think we will maybe be significant in the future with Francis, but it was, of course, all about Serena and Roger, and that's normal and that's great. And I think it's amazing for us because we were the only two people ever like getting to play with Roger and Serena in one court at the same time. So that's like I don't think anyone else ever had that. So yeah, we're really lucky. And just to win what might be the last time. Uh, I, I'd be pretty sad, you know, I, I think, I mean, honestly, like, for me, every week, Hopman Cup would be amazing, so um, I definitely miss it all year, and then looking forward to, year, to it all year, so I'll be really sad if Hopman Cup would not be next year. Thanks, Belinda, good luck in the finals. Thank you. Thank you.